Listen, I'm gonna go live whether you like it or not. Do you know what time I got up this morning? I didn't, I'm still grinding from yesterday. I grind my own coffee, put the margin in the crypto. I'm sorry you can't get a hold of me, but I've been blowing up ever since I bought that property. And by bought, I mean rent. And by rent, I mean I'm staying with my buddy. Listen, my middle name's Hustle. Seto Hustle Renderforestson. Seto from Renderforest here. Okay, so I think I have good content. You think you have good content. We all think we have good content, but how can you get to that next level if you're just starting off? Not everybody's gonna get those followers just from being handsome like me. So this week I'm gonna be talking about our Instagram video maker for reels or for stories and some other tips before you post to Instagram. Reels are basically the equivalent or competitor to TikTok and Snapchat. It gives you a chance to share your story and content not only with your followers, but also to be discovered by Instagram users on the explore page. The interactive part is that you can use hashtags and music tracks on certain effects and your story will come up on that dedicated page. Once people search for it, they'll find your video and click. With Reels, you can change the cover photo image before you post your video to your feed. You can also edit the caption, decide the length, choose your hashtags, and also tag a collaborating account that you're working with and more. Here are some tips to think about if you have a business account on Instagram before you post your next Reel. First idea is to take part in trending challenges or showcase your product or service with trending songs. Number two is give a short tutorial or demo of a product or service that you have. And number three is give your office a quick tour to your followers online. Okay, before you go downloading a specific Instagram video editing app, you can just use your existing RenderForest app. I'll show you how you can make a clean and professional reel or story in just a few steps with your phone. Let's begin. The first thing we're gonna do is go to our Render Forest app and in the search bar, I'm gonna put in Instagram. I'm gonna be using the one called Instagram Real Toolkit and I'm gonna click Create Now. We're gonna be using a loaded preset. I'm gonna use this one called Motivational Instagram Real. I'm gonna use this preset. So we're gonna to go to the first scene. We're gonna click the image, go to camera roll, choose our video, and I'm gonna edit down the video to the first scene that I want. So we're going to edit this down. Once you get to the spot you want, hit done. So for the first field text, I'm going to add my text and get rid of the example. The journey of a thousand miles. Then I'm going to make sure there's no secondary field. I'm only using the first field. All right. So I'm done with this first scene. The second scene, I'm going to do the same thing. Go to camera roll, choose my video, edit my video down to the scene that I want. So it's that second scene with the cup. So edit that down hit done and then add my first field text begins with a single step and then I'm going to delete the example text here for the second field okay so I'm done with the second scene third scene same thing go to camera roll add your video and then we're going to go to the third scene so we're going to edit this down hit done for the third scene we're going to add the first field text when everything feels like an uphill struggle. And then we're gonna get rid of that example text on the field number two. Okay, so we're done with this scene. We're gonna to go to number four. Again, click the picture, camera roll, choose your video. We're gonna to go to the scene with the tent outside. So we're gonna crop it down and edit the video to the tent scene. Okay, here we go, done. I'm gonna edit my text. Think of the view from the top. Now I'm not going to use the second field, so again, just delete the example, hit done. All right, we're done with that scene. And the last scene is kind of like the call to action. So this is the last scene of the pack. We're going to choose our video. And then the last scene is our example character sitting on top of the mountain. We're going to edit it down so it's just him with his dog. Look how cute that dog is. Why would you not want to subscribe? Okay, so follow, we're going to say, Follow Michael Johnson. Michael Johnson had another career change, what again? Okay, hiking, camping, and more. Let's pretend like he's an influencer, but for outdoor stuff. So that's gonna buffer, and then you can go ahead and change your style. In the style, you can change the text. Here you can change music. And then also you can preview from this scene. It's not gonna be a full rendered version. It's just a low quality version, just so you can see how it looks. But here we can see the scenes, make sure the text is the way you want it, the videos are edited the way you want it, and it's all transitioning the way you want. If you want to edit something, you can go back and edit this time too. 
Okay, so I like the way that it looks, and we have the follow, the Michael Johnson, hiking, camping, and more. That's a nice call to action at the end. Okay, a common question a lot of people have is, how can I add music to a reel? I'll show you how you can add music in case you don't want to use music from our library and instead using music from Instagram or instead of using your own track by uploading it through renderbars.com. Okay, so the first thing that you want to do is go to Instagram and then open up the Reels page where you can start shooting your Reel. So instead of shooting your Reel live, you're going to go to your camera roll and then add your video that you just exported from Render Forest. This has the text animation. So then on the left, you'll see the audio button. So after clicking preview, you're going to add your audio. I'm going to choose this song just as an example. Hit done. And then I click preview. So on the top, next to the download icon, you'll see a music note. You can click that music note and then do some more editing. So here you'll see the audio controls. On the left hand side is where it's the original audio track. And then on the right hand side is the new song with, that you uploaded within Instagram. So here you can play around what you can do half and half or completely one or the other. I'm gonna use completely just one for this example with the new song through Instagram. Now, once you go to the next page, you can then edit your cover photo, write your caption, then also you can tag people within this page as well. Once you're done, then you can click share. So what's that current real trend that you love to hate or hate to love? Let me know down in the comments. If you enjoyed this topic, you can read more about it in the linked article blog down below. Thanks for sticking with us so far. Here's a promo code you can use for your first paid subscription, but don't wait too long because it's only good for one month after the video is published. Did you like the intro to this video? You can use the same template, it's linked in the description. If you got something out of this video, be sure to like, share, and subscribe, and ring that bell for future notifications. Thanks, and see you next week.